Hello, and welcome back to... Oh, Big Sip. Big Sip Kip, Caves of Cud. All right, I'm going to give all my um, books out of pure laziness, honestly. 8,247 experience. Did not level. Day 25, still no Jasper. Um, all right, so... What are we doing? I guess we could do some more combing, desert combing, but I I, th I think I promised you a asphalt desert. There's really not, I mean, like, what we should do, you know what, actually, though I did promise a uh, asphalt desert, I think what I should really do is um, comb the salt marsh. Salt marsh. Yeah, well, let's check out the ruins. Reason being is uh, I would like to find some layers and some extra reputation We really do need some love injectors to make all of that happen um, but the good news is that we um, oh, There's a lot of statues Wow Here hold on a second. I want to look at that one as well more Resha floor Yeah, two Russia floor on this on this one ruin. There's a lot of lore here. Damn. Um, the good news is because we're an Esper, uh, we can cook with love injector stuff instead of uh, using them, and therefore we don't need nearly as many. And I'm pretty sure we get five rations of congealed love whenever we. Uh, Oh, hello. I'm hearing a, uh... Oh, yeah, there it is. Oh, this is a obscenely dangerous space-time vortex because I'm pretty sure this is a two-way one and, uh, things can crawl in. I think if we walk in, uh, we, we could have a look at what's on the other side. It's not too bad. Got a Pewtis Templar. That's maybe a bit spicy but um we're just gonna go ahead and dominate them ah i was hoping that i could well i i fortunately i made enemies to everyone as the pewtis templar so don't have to worry about any of that we have a farmer down here we also have a nest let's try and uh deal with that nest did we just hit the Man, I thought the whole point of the lays was that it would never miss. We're we're gonna we're taking some damage here. We have some witchwood bark. Let's go ahead and, and take a witchwood bark. Uh, let's go ahead and take some more witchwood bark. We're gonna start shooting our gun. Uh, we have no more ammo. <laughs> we're, we're not gonna shoot our gun anymore um, Let's go ahead and dom. No, we can't dominate this creature. Let's in let's intimidate them and we'll uh, Kill this leech. No, we won't the leech is actually destroying us right now Okay Can we proselytize? Yes, we can that it might have actually saved our life. Let's go ahead and activate this um, holographic bracelet and throw down a hologram right there and then try and run away uh... Ow Oh, no, we're fine. Can we dominate you? Yes, we can We're just looking to stall the rest of the creatures um, so that I can recover a little bit and that is actually working out pretty well. Our hologram is still there, which is nice. Okay. And we also, we, we have our charges back. All right, cool. That went pretty well. Our hologram, oh, I see our hologram mirrors our actions, I'm pretty sure. Uh, let's go ahead and deactivate that. That did help us quite a bit. In fact, let's go ahead and throw that down again. The, uh, I have really not made enough 
use of the hologram bracelet. I've gotten it in like just about every run. Oh my god. But I have never made use of it. It's funny how they all kind of run straight towards the hologram. I think there must be a beetle nest. I don't know if beetles and centipedes are friends. But I don't... I, I don't know. This is not a great situation to be in right now. Can we dominate you? Yes, we can. No! God damn. I, I think what must be happening here is that our gaslight Chris is drained. Let's go ahead and recharge that. Because we're not really doing any damage. And that's hurting us. Uh, this is a rather annoying cave we have found ourselves in. We're not even getting any experience and we're still getting torn up. Our hologram is still there. Let's see if the, there's a beetle nest over here. Sprint away. There's a lot of junk. Okay, let's um, back ourselves right into a corner and then dominate this lad and then stop everything from attacking us. Never mind. Um, okay. Deactivate hollow bracelet. Activate hollow bracelet. Go! Attack anything but me. Um, proselytize. Unconvinced. Of course. Okay, we have three charges. We should be able to kill three things with that. I'm just gonna let them attack my um, hologram while I attack them occasionally with a laser. Okay, deactivate hologram bra bracelet and recover. Recover. Oh my god, please stop enough enough beetles, please. I don't know what this is, but I want it. Oh, vine weave tunic. Uh, I don't think that's actually very good for us. Oh my god. Okay, we're gonna wait 500 turns and I want my lays back. I want my lays back. I think probably our hologram died. It does use up quite a bit of power to keep on. Oh no, it's still there. Nice. I'm gonna go ahead and dominate the centipede and then attack the centipede nest. Nice. Okay, we have one charge. Let's just kill everything. I don't even know how I got down here, to be honest. Why are we not friends? Okay, we are friends. Good. Um, I thought that the portal was going to be two-way. Um, and I came down here in the hopes of finding something... I guess I wanted to find something spicy and maybe some really good loot. But instead, I found a cave full of beetles and centipedes. Which is just just not very uh, helpful to be honest in the grand scheme of things I bet you there's gonna be another nest over here no maybe not actually all right we could go down there's no up apparently um, let's just recoil out 
go ahead and recoil i don't really have any chart well we, we can recharge it um let's recoil the jopa There we go. Okay, um, I don't know if I've made friends with everyone in Jopa. I, I guess I did, even though it was probably ill-advised. I don't know if I, oh, like I went to the name location. Did I, did I not go there because there's something important? Maybe not. Um, yeah, it's been, it's been a couple of, it's been a lot of adventures and I'm not all of them are very exciting. They're just a lot. We are inspired. Let's go ahead and cook uh, another meal. Choose ingredients. Let's do canned have it all. And uh, let's just do canned have it all. Plus four DV. It was a skulk. So we are now at 70 out of 100 on the uh, Sultanate of Salt achievement. We do not get any experience from killing Snapjaws, nor should we really. Oh, there was something there. Is a chest? Um, nothing really exciting in there. I'm not really expecting to find any loot in the in the salt uh, marsh. I'm just looking to find some layers, um, so I can find some legendary creatures and uh, get some reputation. You know what I wouldn't mind is if we could make a friend and then find some fungus I would actually really like to get some uh, I'd really like to get some some mumbling mouth so we can get some secrets and maybe discover the location of some um, you know uh, Villages because that's also an achievement. We have to find a bunch of randomly generated uh, villages that is on the docket. It's on our checklist. And we also need to find them if we want to uh, get find a new fo uh, a new home for the slint. So. We're just kind of roaming um, the salt de uh, salt marsh for now, looking for layers. It's, it's going to be... I mean, there's going to be a little bit of tedium in this series, I'm afraid. I, I could definitely cut it out, but you never know. Like... Outskirts? What is, what is this? Is this Jopa? I don't know what this is. This is like almost a village. I feel like there's a village there of Shuzuzur. Shuzur? Uh, that's an important location. Yes, we found a settlement. Nice. Okay, let's uh let's make friends. Painted archway of Shuzazor. Shua Shua Zo Sure. Shua Zo Sure. We have a legendary. Uh legendary oh no, that's not legendary, that's just a, the queen here. Loved by villagers and unshelled reptiles. Hated by the den why does everyone have to have some kind of horrible compromise reputation? Like, I cannot afford to take that. I'm, I'm only on, like, par with E3 hold. So I can't really afford to do that. Unless I get, like, I also want to make friends with E3 hold. Like, I want them to be uh, one of the options for the slinth. But just, like, damn, every time. Uh, do you have work? I will find the concentrated flame beard gland paste of the acrobatic partner as you ask. Uh, taken to the red atom. Okay, well, 
maybe the queen also has some uh, has a job for us no okay um warden the wardens in these uh, random uh villages never tend to have reputation and this one is no different it does not which i think is unfair to be honest i think that they should um okay ruins Ra red atom let's go ahead and, and knock this one off the list discover a layer yes let's absolutely check out the layer legendary glowfish perfect legendary glowfish are great because we can actually make friends with them without the need or the use of beguiling or whatever fungicide grenade um disassemble that Explore. Um, a little worried that I've just made enemies. No, okay, we're fine. Worried about anything I attack down here might actually aggro the entire layer on us. But no, we're good. Oh, okay, that's not good. The sewage eels are likely to aggro us if I'm not careful. Yes, it did. Okay, um, what I'm gonna do, we'll rest up. Is that the, that's not a legendary, is it? Ghost perch. Let's, um, oh yeah, now, now we're gonna be aggro to everything. I, what I need to do, okay, we're, are we okay now? Or not? No, we're still not okay. It's okay. Let's, um, we'll kill this stuff. Find the glow pad. If we're aggro with the glow pad, that sucks. But we can come back later and then we'll lose aggro on the glow pad. Oh, an electro bow in this lair. Wow. That would have been a fantastic find. If I was, uh, rifles and bows. Oh, we still have staircases down. This is a very extensive glow pad lair. Okay, you are sucked into a space-time vortex. This is a very vortex-heavy run, is it not? Not sure what did that. Uh, I really don't know what did that. But we are now 14 strata deep in a fungal forest underground. It do be like that sometimes in CUD. One second you're uh, exploring a uh, the layer of a glow pad, and then the next second you're you're in a fungal forest, 15 strata underground. We have a slumberling. Let's hope nothing disturbs the slumberling. We could like dominate them, maybe. Not a terrible thing to do. Pretty sure they have fairly low willpower. Um, let's just go ahead and recoil back out to Jopa. Can't recoil with... I'm standing right next to a slumberling, which makes sense. Context matters, but you know. In that case, it is it is a big whatever. You're still standing right next to a slumberling. Um, what? Oh, right, I was I was going to Red Atom, and then I found the glow pad layer. So this is actually Red Atom, the place I was meant to go to in the first place. Pretty, pretty nice location. There's our concentrated flame, gear, flame beard gland paste of the Acrobatique. Is it? Yeah. Adds powerful fire breathing effects. We'll grab it. I like the chest as well, but um, yeah, we'll grab that too. Okay, now um, I do want to continue checking out that legendary glow pad. I, I just want to find the glow pad.
you you could uh, you can't i have no idea what is happening to be honest and i also have no idea what created a time vortex it might have been me the only thing i can really i guess is that something used a mental attack on me and my mental mirror triggered a vortex We have another staircase leading down. This is the most extensive layer I think I've ever seen for a glow pad. Hopefully that eel did not aggro me to everything else and it did not. This is good. There's more um, eels, unfortunately. And those boulders are... Oh, we have some uh, Lover's Blossom. Amazing. That is going to be useful for us in the future. What do we got here? We got a... We got nothing. There was a bronze nugget there, I think, for a moment. And now there is not. Shucks. You know, easy come, easy go, Incud. If I'm really smart, I'll, na I'll have named the episode that... But chances are what happens is I bulk record a bunch of episodes and then in the far future when I go to like naming the episode and also like doing the thumbnail, um, I forget what happened in that episode. I do a very cursory glance um, through the, you know, just kind of like scrolling through the video to try and surmise some kind of theme. But I forgot if, if ever I named it something in the episode, I'm like, nah. I'll do that later and then I forget and then it's gone forever. So here's uh, here's your, you know, behind the scenes commentary of, well, this is why it wasn't named Easy Come, Easy Go, which would have been a good name for the episode. Nothing in that. No, I don't want to store anything. Glow, these glowfish are actually kind of whittling me down. Still have yet to find a legendary glow pad. Oh, this is a legendary glowfish. Oh, this is Lair of Ithus, legendary glowfish, and I am currently fighting the, the, the legendary creature in question. Um, disliked by the villagers of Kekyuka. I don't want to be enemies to fish, but um, reputation for the villagers of Kekyuka is actually not bad. We actually get some Snapjaw rep, which is weird. Sect of the Pest of Suazuma. That's pretty good reputation. Not bad. Not terrible. You know, eight, eight Rotkas, whatever. I forget what the, uh, the actual number is. Isn't it like seven vod Rotkas? I like that overnight, everyone knew what a Rotka it was. Just suddenly. Um, okay, so now we want to go back to our other, our new named location and hand in our uh, flame ble beard gland. Nice, got some reputation. I mean, it's basically nothing, but we also get a bunch of injectors um, if we want them. Could also take some books. Yeah, let's take some injectors. Oh, I have swelled with the inspiration to name our plate armor. Name it based on the uh, the Octoloc Carlotl legendary flame beard culture. Sure. Let's commemorate this um this moment by naming my armor after your your culture. Sounds good. A lot of staircases leading down. Is this part of the village? Are these like little, little houses? Little houses for all of the crocs? They, they kind of feels a little kind of homey. Except for these uh, snap jaws. All right, let me go ahead and deal with that. Unless you guys are keeping him as a pet, in which case I'm very sorry. Okay, so I believe I was uh, sweeping left as I found this village. 
So well, let's continue sweeping left. We found a village. We got we got we found a lair. What do you mean I discover the red atom? I already discovered the red atom and I I dealt with it. Uh, I have yeah a funny feeling our gaslight Chris has uh, drained. This is really gonna be a drain on our resources until I find a better chem cell or I guess I could throw the solar <clears throat> chem cell in there, but I don't think the solar cell is strong enough to keep it um, keep it charged and also is you know, as soon as I get transported underground, which will happen, then it'll be a problem. I do get a little tip from uh, my friend of the channel birdie um, that said that uh, if you are if you care about power generation and want to deal with that crap just get rid of it entirely <clears throat> um, blood cells are actually a really good means of doing so uh, let's see what we got here hated by flowers hated by mollusks admired by flowers okay so we have we have very neutral um, flower reputation it, it kind of breaks even and then we have snapjaw rep of course and mollusk rep so we kind of lose nothing except for the snapjaw rep i don't think i really care about making friends with snapjaws the best part about making friends with snapjaws is that you have the option of making friends with other snapjaws kind of tempting honestly i i mean do i care about mollusk reputation kind of it's nice to be friends with mollusks but it would be nicer to be friends with snapjaws in a way there's Way more uh, potential for um, reputation gathering when making friends with Snapjaws than, uh, you know, anyone else. So, yeah, you know what? I guess I do care. Let's go ahead and uh, book it. Oh, they're actually quite fast. You know what? Let's go ahead and set a hologram. Uh, and then I'm gonna write, make a pin south one snap jaw rep. Sounds good. I, I I'm really appreciating this hologram bracelet actually. Uh, I don't know where I was. Too famished. Oh, and we're also inspired. Let's uh, cook a meal. You know what? Let's preserve our exotic. We'll cook with some rubber gum injector. Um, don't really want to cook with my blaze injector. Those are too useful. Choose ingredients. Let's do um, rubber gum and honey. Rubber honey, you know? You only get ill for one-tenth the usual length of time. When you jump, you may immediately jump again. You do me making the pancakes today. Okay. Um... So I want to go... Mm, oh. Okay, I was gonna... I, I Legendary Snapjaw Shotgunner. Okay. Let's check out this place. Asphalt Weep. Uh, the only reason I'm checking this place out is to see if there's a Legendary Snapjaw. A warrior with some important or uh, noteworthy reputation. Oh, we got some luminous shrooms. Jeez, I am getting like r severely whittled down by both bleeding and that. Get out of here, buddy. I like the effects to indicate that we've uh, reached our our maximum charges for lays. Really appreciate those, actually. This has been a relatively chill fungal forest, so we don't have to worry too much about um, fungal infections. At least not yet. We have a shotgunner snap uh, snap jaw. And they are a fungus ridden. They do have fickle fickle gill. Now it's really annoying, but I'm pretty sure if I shoot him, I don't actually find out. Oh, well, that sucks. 
I don't get to find out, um, you know, what kind of fungus, what, what color that, uh, fungal or a fickle cell is. I, I've tried to, like, suss this out in a number of runs. Like, is there a way of figuring out, uh, fickle gill ahead of time, ahead of, you know, like, without contracting it yourself? And sort of maybe yes, kind of no. It's, it's a really tricky one, and I, I... I don't know. It's it's rather bothersome. Um, what do we got? Something is weighing us down, and I'm not sure what. Cybernetics artifacts? Yeah, that would be the case. High capacity solar cell. Well, that's kind of nice. We have a Sphinx salt injector. Nano pneumatic ja jackhammer. That would be what is weighing us down. Let's take that chem cell and uh, treat these as scrap and disassemble. Pump shotgun. Disassemble that business. All right, we're back in business. Got some really nice sound effects. I really, I am really enjoying a lot of these sound effects. Okay. Um, so what I want to do is go back to the village here and then head east because I was kind of combing and then things went awry. Look, nice little touch of detail, by the way. I never noticed this before, but, um, if you see a village is, is very clearly farming dread tubers, it's because they're farming salve injectors. Like they're, they're basically a salve injector village. Oh no, there's our friend. Whom, whom I would like to make friends with. We'll just kind of, we'll, we'll leave them here. They're fine. I think they'll, I think they'll stick around there. I would love to, I don't think I have a love injector, do I? I don't think I do. No. Wouldn't that be nice? Um, I have a love blossom, but I don't know how to make a love injector, unfortunately. I have to figure that one out, and I can only figure that out if I have a love injector and then, um, you know, go, go back to Ezra, which is yet another adventure. Oh, look at that. The episode is over. I really got to be better about these things. You, you'll you get more episodes if I'm a little bit better about cutting them off uh, prematurely, unfortunately. Um, that's just how it works. Um, if you're enjoying the series, definitely hit the, epi uh, hit the episode. Hit that like button and consider subscribing for more content like this. And um, thank you very much to the supporters of the coffee. I really appreciate y'all. You're, you're doing, doing amazing work. I really appreciate it. And if you're interested, I have launched a Discord for the purposes of notifying you when I have uh, uploaded a new video or when I've started streaming. Or if you want to chat with other like-minded simples, then you can check out the Discord. It's got some extra goodies and um, you can opt out of notifications really easy. Uh, it's the first thing you, you're prompted to do. But anyway, uh, I'll see you guys next time. Take it easy. Uh, have a good day. Yeah.